Introducing the Performance Parameters Display, PPD for short. PPD is a computer module that interfaces with your car's instrument cluster to display various bits of sensor data without the need to hack or permanently modify your car's OEM interior. The unit is plug and play to allow for easy installation and removal, if necessary. PPD has a built-in map sensor which allows the unit to display vacuum and boost. It also has external analog sensor inputs which allow additional sensor data to be displayed. In the current mode, live boost or vacuum and air fuel ratio are being displayed. PPD was designed for performance enthusiasts. With that said, it is critical that drivers stay focused on the road while under acceleration. PPD facilitates this by capturing and replaying data captured immediately after you stopped acceleration. Boost recall mode shows life boost data, peak boost, taper boost, and the respective RPM they were achieved. What you see here is a quick replay of the AFR values captured during this pass. This is incredibly useful data that would be very difficult to accurately monitor under extreme acceleration using standard gauges. PPD also includes a performance monitor, which currently allows you to instantly test your car's ability to go from 0 to 60. It also includes a FATS test. FATS is a popular performance measurement technique used by B5 Audi S4s to measure the time taken to accelerate from 4200 RPM to 6500 RPM in third gear. PPD was designed to be modular. The base unit's capability can be expanded via add-on modules. At launch, a micro-shift LED and an integrated boost controller will be available. Hopefully you've noticed a bright blue light as the car approaches redline. That light is coming from the shift light add-on. It's a very small plug-and-play LED that plugs into the base unit and can be programmed to match your car's rev limit. The integrated boost controller is a small plug-and-play module that allows PPD to control your N75 solenoid. You have the option of programming three boost maps, which can be activated instantly through the OEM menu control stock. I personally love this feature. It potentially allows the driver to run a conservative boost profile for daily driving and enhance engine and turbo reliability, while providing the option to run aggressive boost profiles at the click of a button. Last but not least, PPD serves as a permanent data logging device. The unit is capable of storing more than 1,000 hours of full throttle data logs. This is done automatically whenever the driver goes full throttle. The logs can be retrieved using your computer at a later date and are date and time stamped. Many of these features allow you to enjoy your car and tune your car without the constant need to lug your laptop around. The data logs can be retrieved at a later date, reviewed for lean, rich, underboost or overboost conditions, and then make tuning changes accordingly. Additionally, it also provides a monitoring mechanism for your car. Imagine this. You drop your car off for basic maintenance, only to have the service technician take your car for a joyride. The data logs are timestamped and store RPM, engine speed, throttle position, boost, AFR, and potentially other data items. The next time they try this, they will have been caught red-handed. <laughs>